morning. It's July the 5th, 2014, the day after Independence Day. I had a wonderful day yesterday, and of course, we're the whole weekend is kind of uh, dedicated to this. A lot of people with friends and family, and uh, God and country. We sort of celebrated that yesterday. I was with my daughter uh, Jennifer and her family, uh, Scott Kirshner and the children, uh, for a couple hours yesterday, and that was very nice. And the um, special time was that the half hour that my two grandsons, Andrew and Cameron Kirshner, uh, one just Cameron just graduated from high school, and Andrew's eleventh grader. We watched um, the Billy Graham 95th birthday uh, special, The Hope for America. We watched that on Independence Day, The Hope for America, The Cross. And uh, you watch it, and uh, if you haven't, you need to see it. It's it's very well done, I think, and it'll be uh, touch your heart. And, uh, I cry about it every time I watch it. So uh, I, I will attach that to the to my send out today so I, I hope you click on to it when you have a chance got a half hour to spend watching it this will be about four minutes here now let's look here in the bible psalm uh 51 10 create me a clean heart and renew a right spirit within me create me a clean heart the heart the heart of man is desperately wicked who can know it Create me a clean heart. I remember, well, it's been several months back now, my older brother's old time, he sent me, uh, it was either a text or an email, I don't remember, but it was this verse was on it. Create me a clean heart and renew a right spirit within me. I thought that was very good. I was glad my older brother was thinking on that and sent it to me. Um, but that's what you and I need. Uh, we need to have a, a heart transplant. My, that's helped a lot of people and extended people's lives but you and I need a new heart we, we need a pliable heart a soft heart get rid of our stony wicked heart of sin and and uh, have it you know you can't have a right spirit uh, you, if, if your spirit's not right it's because your heart's not right the heart and the spirit go hand in hand if you're always negative and sorry and nasty and jumping on everybody and can't get along with anybody. It's because your heart's not right. You got you got a you got a heart problem. It's you just, oh that's just the way I am. No, you got to get a heart change. Create me a clean heart. This was told to David, the man after God's own heart that we read about today in our New Testament reading Acts chapter thirteen. Old Testament is Job thirty thirty one, but um, Acts chapter thirteen tells it David was a man after God's own heart. So what is your, uh, how is your heart? Do, have, have you ever, we sing that little song in Sunday school, into my heart, into my heart, come into my heart, Lord Jesus, come in today, come in to stay, come into my heart, Lord Jesus. Hope you've got him in your heart. I hope you've been born again. You've trusted Christ as your only way and hope for forgiveness of sins and a home in heaven. If you've never done that, uh, you, need, you need to do it today.